Crypto Lightsaber back with another video guys. We are going to talk about Ronin Finance. This is an update video. The website is now up looking pretty bullish, pretty bullish. It's got that Neo Tokyo type of vibe. Ronin I believe is another word for Samurai, correct me if I'm wrong. Um, so it's got that, you know, it's got the theme uh, to a T. Um, but we're not here to invest in art and fancy pictures and fancy websites. It's all about the tokenomics, the community, uh, the pumper mentors, whatever you want to say, okay, um, how will this thing perform? I believe it's going to do pretty well. It's going to be pretty bullish. From what I'm hearing, it's going to be coming out the gate at 120k market cap. So, you know, even if you don't get the whitelist, okay, if you manage to get this, you know, once it launches, which is tomorrow in about 24 hours, um, you could buy this very early. And if it goes to, you know, uh, 1.2 million market cap, you've already 10 x 12 million, uh, you know, 120 million, you do the numbers on that. So there's a lot of potential for this getting in this at the ground floor. Um, it's a fork of Phantasm and Titan. Now, I'm not, you know, the most clued up about what Phantasm is. Um, I have seen it before, uh, but I've looked into it a little bit more since um, I've heard about Ronin. I'm not sure what Titan is, but, um, you know, algorithmically backed stablecoin projects normally perform pretty well we've seen the way elephant money has performed might be a bad example because of their exploit but in terms of the token and the uh you know the the, the uh, price action of the token that is pretty bullish so yeah um pre-sale goes live in about three hours take advantage and also i wanted to talk about the miner because i didn't cover the miner um when i spoke about this in the last video so they are going to be having a miner but it's a stable coin miner so if it wasn't clear to you the Ronin token is the stable coin, okay, which is backed by, um, is backed by the cyber token. So when you buy the Ronin Finance uh, project, you're actually, excuse me, you're actually buying the cyber token, okay. So we're getting the cyber token. That's what we're investing in. Obviously, you can't make yield. Uh, you, well, you can't make. Um, gains on a stable coin just by holding it okay so the ronin stable coin is an algorithmic coin which is collateralized by uh the cyber token okay and they have a miner and it's guaranteeing you a daily apr it doesn't say what the daily apr is but you can compound daily to increase your apr up to three percent a day on a stable coin okay so a lot of people are going to find that pretty bullish. The miner is actually going to launch between one and one and a half weeks after Ronin Finance goes live. So about one, one and a half weeks from now. We're not sure. Uh, but that's what it says here. And, you know, that could be a pretty bullish thing. Now, what I'm thinking is, is this going to be more like your baked beans, Grinch, Grinch box type of miner? Or is it going to be more like your piggy bank? um you know piggy bank type of thing or splash pads or whatever okay um but yeah i'm not sure but there's potential for this to obviously be a big thing and um you know it's utility it's, it's giving utility to the ronin token and there's also utility for the cyber token so in order to mint the ronin stable coin right you're going to need to use a portion of your cyber to partially back the peg Okay, and when you redeem your Ronin, a portion of your redeem value will be returned in BUSD and a portion returned in Cyber. So similar again to Elephant Money and things like that. So if you are familiar with those types of projects, obviously, you know, uh, you should be bullish or I'm bullish anyway on this project. None of this is financial advice, by the way. But yeah, I just wanted to highlight that because I didn't highlight it in the previous video. Um, but yeah, I think this could be a pretty pretty good project um there are medium articles as you can see they're keeping with that neo tokyo theme and um, you can read all about it okay if you're not sure um you know what it has to offer read all about it because at the end of the day you're parting with your hard-earned money all right and you want to be sure that you're investing in something that you believe in for me we're seeing people like barter town um crypto talk myself um several other inf influencers talking about this project you know, uh, DeFi Dude did a video earlier. So a lot of people are back in this project. So for me, the community is there. All of those aspects are there. I don't expect them to stop there 
at making videos. There's going to be more promotion on this. Um, from the feedback that I get in certain Telegram groups that I'm in, people are going to be holding this token. People are bullish on it. Uh, someone said that the last Titan fork or Phantasm fork did a thousand X. Someone else said 60 X. So there is potential for this from the feedback that I'm getting. And I'm bullish on this project personally. Okay, so I will be holding onto my pre sale tokens. I won't be selling any. Okay, not unless we see, you know, astronomical gains at the end of the day. You've got to lock in some profits. That's just smart. Okay, but I will be holding this to see exactly why it can achieve, at least for the short to mid term. Okay, uh, not sure about the long term. We'll have to wait and see how the project performs. Because, you know, these things, if they pump, you know, a long term hold can very quickly become a short term hold in crypto. Because if you get a thousand X, 5,000 X or whatever, you know, something crazy like that. At the end of the day, you've got to take profit. This is smart to take profit. You can always buy some more back on the dip. But yeah, at least in the short to mid term, I plan to hold this token uh, because I'm bullish on it. OK, I'm bullish on it. All the feedback that I'm getting tells me that we might have found a gem right here. So I'm going to leave all the links in the description. None of this is financial advice. It's just my opinion. Take advantage of it. All right, if you've got a whitelist, um, I don't recommend you put the 0.5 BNB at the end of the day. I recommend you do exactly what I'm doing. Put in a whole 1 BNB. I wish I could put more, but that's all they're giving us, okay? But um, one thing I will say is we spoke about, um, you know, allocations in our Telegram group, Crypto, Crypto Insomniac Telegram group earlier. And people were talking about, you know, not being able to put their 0.1 BNB or 0.2 BNB. You can't expect to get something for nothing, Okay. When you invest in a project like this or any private sale or anything like that, what you're doing is you're saying, you know what, I believe in the vision of this project. I'm going to take a punt on it. I'm going to put my money where my mouth is and I'm going to support the project. I'm going to support their roadmap. I'm going to help them raise the money for liquidity. I'm going to help them raise the money for marketing and things like that. So, you know, putting a little 0.2 BNB, for example, in my opinion, that's just like getting something for nothing. Because if this does you know, something crazy like previous forks have this done or any other project like that that does, you know, gains like that. It's like you got something for nothing um, at the earliest stage without really, really trusting the project, okay? Uh, that's just my opinion. Uh, so in my opinion, uh, what I'm going to be doing is putting the whole B&B. It's not, you know, I'm not going to miss it. I understand that everybody else has different financial circumstances. But if I only had one B&B and that's all I had, and I had an opportunity like this, I would still put the whole one BNB in. Okay, uh, I, I when I started in crypto, I started with a very small amount of money, um, took some risks, major risks, even took out loans at one point, and um, you know it paid off. So, at the end of the day, no risk, no reward. All right, guys. That being said, remember, not financial advice, just giving you my opinion. Um, subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed already. Tip the little bell for notifications. I will see you guys in the next video.